Hi, I am Stu Max. On the previous video, we built the first half of our steam train, and on this one, we will continue on the rest of the carriage. But before we start, be sure to do like and subscribe, and you can follow me on Patreon to support the channel and get access to the download for this train and all my builds. Link will be in the description. Now let's build. We will now have the coupling the next carriage, and the way I would do it is that I would have only one gangway in the back of each carriage, and so when you connect. The gangway of the first car will be the front of the second. I do hope that makes sense. And we are now at the second carriage. In this carriage, I cleared everything on the inside except the vestibule. In this car, we have the door on the back. Let's replace all the floors and get it divided back up. We're we'll using a black terracotta and brass casing for the floor. Get the cabinet area set up. We use a brass funnel for this one. Wait a minute, <laughs> that's a trap chest. Now get the brass lamps on there as well. Same as on the entrance. All right, let's get all the seats in here. We're gonna use the blue seats on this one. Train trap doors and all the decorations. Add some flowers in here as well. Alright, let's get another seats here. And on this side, I think I'll change it up a bit. With the snare counters, using beehives. Decorate the top just a little. At the back here, I think I will make it a large area. Some fancy tables. And there is the first second class car. But let's get another carriage for the second class. For this one, I think I'll move the door to the front. Now, the interior on this carriage, I think it'll mostly be normal seats. Well, there used to be a door on the section in the old design. You can have it be a normal seat, or you can change it a bit. That looks nice. But let's try and not make the decors look too repetitive. Light the place of the candles. Right, then let me check the lighting real quick. And I want the inside to be glaringly bright. Right, that is all for the second class. Oh, missed the table here. Now on to the first class. I got a completely empty car right here. Also remove the vestibules. Let's change the floor on the side to brass casing. This would be a corridor to walk through the cabins. And now we will make a cabin layout. It seems we got an extra cabin on this coach. Now raise up the wall with the brass casing and shaping the ceiling for each room. And finishing the wall on the side using a copycat panels. Chisel deep slate on the top, and the bottom will be a train casing. 
Maybe let's make it a dark old trap doors. And the door. Now change the open mode to manual, just to reduce the lag. And now we do the rest to the other rooms. Change the floor cabin to black terracotta. We have the seats on both sides, the luggage rack, and the decorations. And don't forget the lighting. And adding a funnel really gives it a final touch. Pretty cozy in here. And now add a frame slabs in between the cabins. And give it a texture. And a small cabinet in this corner. Maybe I'll change the floor at the entrance to industrial iron. Looking great from the outside. Now for the last carriage, might not gonna be useful in Minecraft, but it's certainly gonna look good. But it's the observation car. Another empty carriage. It's got a vestibule on this one. We're gonna add just one seat divider here. It's gonna have the same seats like the second class, but I'll change the table. Then this whole area would be the bar. Place the bar counter right here. Decorate the wall just a bit. And up here would be the cabinet. I made this a dark oak, so there isn't too much brass colors. Some flowers on the counter. I will light up this room with a lantern. Right, the bar is looking great. Let's finish up the wall panels. Should have done this before I put up the cabinets. <laughs> I'll add a contraption control on this carriage. Maybe if you don't want to have a door open on here when you're approaching the stations. I'm finishing up these corners with the small tables. And place down the carpets. Carpet looks great. Well, let's get a placard up there. There we go. And now it's time for the observatory. Let's break down everything in the back here. Add another funnel here and here. Continue the oakum texture in the ceiling.
placing down seeds right here and maybe some flowers. And I'll just make a railing. And we use an side bar for the texture. Looking good. But let's add an emergency cobbler in the back. Now I do wonder if I can make the floor be a brass casing. Looks great. Right. Now we just have to glue everything together. Start with the locomotive. We will have to glue the locomotive and tender separately. Don't forget a smokestack. And by the way, should we make the gangway behind the tender? Yeah, let's do that. Right, there's the gangway. Now let's glue the thing. Another carriage. And there's one carriage. Four more. Right, I guess that's everything. And here we go. We've got a new train. Thank you all so much for watching, it has been a lot of fun designing and building this, so I do hope you enjoy this as much as I am. The schematic for this train will be available on my Patreon, I have a train station coming real soon so be sure to check that out. And thank you all my patrons for the support that you've given, I am gladly appreciated. Have a nice day to you all, and I'll see you in the next one.